hope versus wish. The words hope and wish cause a lot of problems in English. This video will help you understand and use these words correctly. We hope it will be helpful and we wish you good luck. Let's get started. When it comes to hope and wish, there are three things that you need to be aware of. Possibility versus fantasy, goodwill, and requesting and planning. We'll look at each of these individually. Number one, possibility versus fantasy. Note the differences. I hope I can go to the party on Saturday. Maybe I will be there. I wish I could go to the party on Saturday. I won't be there. Here are the differences between these two situations. With hope, there is a real possibility that it will happen. I hope I can have a puppy. Maybe I will get one soon. With wish, there is no possibility. It will only happen in your imagination. I wish I could have a puppy. I can't have a puppy. It won't happen. It's only in my dreams or imagination. There's also a difference in the grammar that we use. With hope, there is a possibility that something will happen. So we use verbs like can and will. With wish, the situation is only hypothetical or imagined. It is contrary to fact. We use hypothetical verbs like could and would. For example, I hope I can be rich, or I hope I can become rich. It might happen if you work hard. I wish I could be rich, or I wish I were rich. The fact is, you are not rich. Keep dreaming. 2. Goodwill. Wish is often used to express goodwill in certain situations. We wish you a Merry Christmas, or we wish you a Happy Birthday. With hope, we need to use a that clause with have. For example, we hope that you have a nice holiday. We hope you have a happy birthday. Sometimes that can be omitted. Hope to versus wish to. An interesting situation is when we use the word to along with hope and wish. Note the differences. I hope to speak to Mr. Chance. Maybe I will have an opportunity to see him tomorrow. Only one person is involved in the planning or thinking ahead. I wish to speak to Mr. Chance. That means I would like to speak to Mr. Chance. I'm making a formal request usually of a secretary or receptionist. Two people are involved in the scheduling. I'm asking for someone's help or permission. Here's a sample interaction at a reception's desk. A. I wish to make an appointment with doctor's order. This is quite formal. B. She has time on Friday at 4 o'clock. Does that work for you? Yes. Please put me down for that time. I hope to see you then. I might be out of the office that day. Great. Friday at 4 then. Could I get your name? We hope that you learned something new. And we hope you can remember it. Are you ready for a test? We wish you good luck. Test yourself. Fill in the blanks with either hope or wish. Feel free to stop the video if you'd like more time for this.
Here's the answer key. 1. I hope you can come to Phoenix to see me. 2. I hope to get an A on the geography final. 3. I wish you good luck at your job interview. 4. I hope I can see you again in the future. 5. I wish you a happy Thanksgiving holiday. 6. I wish I could speak Vietnamese. 7. I hope you do well in the Boston Marathon. 8. I wish I could help you, but I'm really busy now. 9. I wish to make an appointment with Dr. Frantic. 10. I hope you have a nice time in Cancun. 11. I wish I could go with you. Have a great vacation. 12. I hope I succeed in this game. Wish me luck. 13. I hope they give me a raise at my company. 14. I wish you wouldn't do that. Hope that was helpful. Please remember to subscribe and give us a thumbs up if you liked this video. If you have ideas for our next one, please let us know at the link below. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. ESLgold.com and FreeEnglishStudy.com